Just how to make a simple bracelet. First, you cut a strap, then you overlap the ends. Of course, you want to put your snap in, and then you use a hole punch to punch both sides so that this way it'll line up perfectly and it'll be even. So. After you cut out your holes, then you're gonna to put together your snap. So this is gonna be the bottom. These are stainless steel snaps, so you have to be careful how you put these together because they will deform sometimes. Just tap it a couple times just to make sure that you're getting a nice, even deformation of the base. Take your time. It's nicely evenly deforming and not going off to one side, which can sometimes happen because stainless steel is going to be a little bit harder than, than the brass snaps. You have steel snaps too that are going to be just as hard to deform and sometimes they will also deform to the side. But here you just keep going until it looks very even. And there you go. The snap is set nicely and it doesn't rotate. So that's the bottom part of the snap. Now you want to put the top on. So. For that we reverse the die. And here's the two parts you need for the top of the snap. Once again, you line it all up. I want to put some pressure down on this so that this way you make sure that you have enough material for the snap to grab onto. And there you see it, it's deforming perfectly. It's not going off to one side. So you're pushing this down against the leather. That's that. This is, you try to turn this, it will not turn. It is very nicely and evenly deformed and flared out to the edges. So now you have your snap and your bracelet is done. To finish the bracelet, what I did use was a uh, Kiwi scuff cover in brown. Uh, this gives you a nice finish. Uh, this was from Veg Tan Leather that had already been embossed and I got that at Hobby Lobby. And uh, then I just gave it one coat. So it gives it a nice shiny surface. And it makes it look very nice. Put this on and you're all set. I also used that to finish the edges. I didn't do the inside, but uh, this makes for a cute little bracelet. This one is very, very small, so it's definitely for uh, somebody with a small wrist. So. 
Hope you enjoyed this video and learn how to set the snaps. This is the snap tool. And this is the bottom part where you put your snaps to form them. So make sure you always keep this in a bag with your, with your snaps. I have these in the Ziploc bag. Keep it all together. Thank you for watching. See you on the next video.